So welcome to a new video in Curzon Street in Bergamo. If you want to see the station site, there's another video. I'll link it here. But this is more to do with the actual construction of the, the viaduct. We're going to take a flight over towards them now. Have a look what's going on. I'm going to have to stay away from the site because there is a crane in operation. I've actually seen it. It's live. You can see it in the distance there. The boom is being used. So we'll, we're going to stay on the, off site today we'll try and capture as much as we can maybe go a bit higher than normal lots of movements here on in Birmingham today it's uh, the 21st October you see there's another cement wagon coming in let's see what's actually going on here then so we're gonna walk along the road the drone's nice and far away from the site in fact having been here before it's probably going to be even higher than the crane for the majority of it. But any time I go across the border, we'll make sure it's up and away and not causing any distractions. So there's the viaducts in progress. Let's see what this crane's bringing in. It's got something on the end of it. A little bit closer. starts to move around that's why we're definitely not going on site today You can see that the crane in operation. There's a lot going on here today. I'm going to pop the drone up a bit higher, 41 meters there. We have a scan of the uh, the viaducts themselves. as you're occurring on that far one today. look back across the entire site such a big big area of land that's been worked on here in Birmingham and down now to see the access road the dry ducks Crane starts to kick into life again. Spin it around.
bit towards the end. Looks like there's a, a lot more progress actually happened on these. I think you can tell from down on the floor. As I disappear into a tree with the drone right above my head, maintaining that line of sight. There was a fire alarm here when I arrived, there still is. There's no emergency. Fire crews are just leaving. Again, as we look back. Such a huge sight here. What we're going to do, we're going to fly over here where they're building the bridge which is assumed to be going to be built in situ and moved by rams as they're doing at St Albans and we'll have a look at that in a moment some big cranes in operation down here past the University of the Fire Alarm going off. That bridge is visible now hidden by a tent. Right there. As we come over the top, I do I'll head down because my car is actually parked down there and get some footage of actually the area around the back and I'll pop it in. Just moved along and are now next to the Lawley Street Railway Viaduct. So this is a, a listed structure and the railway is going to pass over the top of the railway here. So these are those piers that have been seen from the other side from Curzon Street. Pretty in place today. There's one there and there's one on the other side. The train is going to come into the uh, Curzon Street station on the other side there, across here and across the top of this listed viaduct. And we are stay nice and high and out of the way. These people are working here. This is the uh, West Midlands Fire Brigade, I believe. And that'll go up nice and high. We should hopefully be able to see where this is going to cross. The railway. There's a big heavy lift crane in place. Further down is where my car is. You see this, these viaducts will crop, put the bridge straight across the railway line. The rail line will run over here. There's your angle of arrival. Nice and high. Not going to pass over the railway line with the interference and everything else. Plus, there's a lot of work going on here. Let's so move out the way of a car. You see the 
piers there being constructed as they run down towards the city centre station at Curzon Street. So just a very different angle from what we've had before. There's that bridge that will be built on site in the tent and lifted across. Plenty of work going on here on a weekday. I know a lot of people say there's never anything in the videos. They are normally filmed on a weekend. Uh, come on a weekday and you can see plenty happening. That's that part there. So we'll definitely have to come back and see this progress. A big heavy lift crane. We'll get a close up of that from where the car is.